Hi guys, so I want to show you two ways that I like to make my eyes pop when I'm wearing glasses. So yeah. First things first is um, doing your eyebrows. I've noticed that when I wear my glasses, it's better to have a fuller eyebrow. So I like to use um, a brush to kind of brush them into place. I like to brush them up and then I brush them over. But if they're extra wild for some reason, then I'll use um, a brow gel to shape them. So I'm just using some powder to fill in my eyebrows, but I probably use pencil most of the time just because I'm often in a hurry. <laughs> And when I'm done, I like to go in and kind of just like blend this inward a little bit to get a little product off so it's not too like eyebrow. Okay, so we're going to start with um, some black liquid eyeliner. I like to start in the middle of my eye, draw a straight line across, and then fill in the space underneath kind of create a winged eye but I'm going to go a little bit thicker than I normally would and then once I do this half of it then I move into the inner corners of my eye make a thin line and then kind of build it to blend it in do whatever you want you basically want a thicker than you normally go for winged eyeliner situation <laughs> You're gonna grab some darker blue or navy blue eyeshadow. I'm gonna use this color right here. You're going to either use water or contact solution or you can use eye drops and you want to just do like one drop, especially for um, a palette that's this small. It might be a little watery at first. I'm swirling it around with my eyeliner brush. Um, you might need to give it a second to dry out a little bit, but you want it to kind of be um, Pasty. Once it kind of gets to that consistency, you're going to use it to line under your eye. You don't want to line your waterline, but just get as close to it as you can. I like to just go all the way up and wing it out right under the black eyeliner. Your eyeshadow will dry out kind of fast, so just put another drop in. Now you're going to take your black coal eyeliner. You're just going to align your waterline, so just take your time. Try not to get it on the blue, or get it on the blue, and be okay with it. Curl your eyelashes if you want to. I'm using Maybelline's Great Lash, and it's in IC Blue. This is a limited edition one, but they also have this in the color Royal Blue, and they always have the Royal Blue one. And then just put a crap load of mascara on. This is what it looks like without my glasses. This is what it looks like with my glasses on. Different day, different shirt. I had gotten up extremely early yesterday, fell asleep like halfway on the floor. Okay, so for the second look, you're gonna take that same eyeshadow that you were using earlier, wet it with your contact solution. Again, you're gonna use the eyeliner brush. You're gonna do the same winged eyeliner that you did with the black, so like a, a kind of a thicker winged eyeliner, but you're gonna use the um, eyeshadow that you made into a liquid eyeliner. <laughs> Again, like last time, you're gonna bring the blue under your eye, close to your waterline, but not on it. Then you're gonna use a cold pencil to put some black on your waterline. You're gonna take your blue mascara and just apply that again. After you apply your blue mascara, you want to let it completely dry before you move on to the next step. I forgot to curl my eyelashes before I put the blue mascara on, so I'm just going to do that now that they're dry. Take some black mascara and go over the blue. I like to give it a pretty good coat with the black mascara, but once I'm done, you can still kind of see the blue mascara. I think it kind of gives a more dimensional look. If you don't want to do both of them, I suggest just doing the black mascara. Alright, so there you have it. This is look number two. This is it without glasses. And then this is it with my glasses. Let me know which look you like and even if you like it with or without glasses. I hope you like this video. Till next time. Bye! Curl your eyelashes.